Heh, <laughs> Uh. Well then, it's past Poketober, but we're still playing Pokemon Fire Red. For Gaming Chronicles, I'm Capital M Mantis Liano, joined by Mr. Grenball Zay and Halsey. Heyo! And uh, last time we played, which was for the month of October, uh, we beat Brock with our stupendous team of Pokemans. Yes, his rock hard Pokemon. Uh, filthy. Uh, our team, for those who don't remember, <laughs> consists of this bunch of marauders. Lucy Sacks the Pikachu. I, we just got her right before we went into uh, Fight Rock. <laughs> Scat Rat, the Rattata. Scat, 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 scat. The best of our whole breed here, MC Flaps. It's the best name. Look at him. He's just the best thing he, ever. He's 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 spitting it right now. He's, yeah. he's laying it down. <laughs> Everyone else is just mm. yeah, they're to bottom the to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smog, our nice. flaming dragon, uh, Mon Archery. I don't know why I named it that. The Mon Butterfree. Mon Archery. Mo oh, was it Mon? See, I can't even yeah. get it right, and I named it. And then Pig Fusay. Pig Fusay. <laughs> the uh, the lady Mankey, and he we beat Brock. He needs a cigar. It's a girl. She needs. A she cigar. needs a cigar. <laughs> pig, oh yeah, pig and pig her pig. name happens to be. Uh, a lot of people that watched the videos previously were just calling him Jobino. It wasn't Jobin Jobin male. It's just Jobino. So I think that's what we need to do from here on out. Is Jobino his official Jobino. name? And yeah, we're back. Uh, better than ever. I don't even know what that means. The team is safe. I'm not even sure what there is left to do here. All right, so we're done with Pewter City. We got to move on. Onward and upward. So long, stink town. <laughs> 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 hey, that was a water attack. <laughs> you could be all of Brock's Pokemon with that. Um, We don't need to go there. No. The museum. So, uh, since the game... I'm sorry, since we played this last, there's something around here. Uh, Pokemon X and Y have come out. I have spent a good uh, a good million hours playing it so far. Okay, so he's got nothing to offer me. And um, I like it a lot. They did a really nice job in upgrading the graphics. I mean, the entire game was stripped. Like, it looks nothing like the game you're looking at right now. Like, nothing. And by nothing, I mean the locales and stuff are the same, but there's no, you know, none of this layout is, is the same. It's not top down. It's more like on an angular side. It's not like black and white no I totally do it's completely 3d i mean mm. model wise and stuff they they started the oh oh jobino oh hi oh hi okay good yeah no story running finally for the love of god i thought he was gonna serve us never say you're jobino i'm giving you shoes please let me put them on your feet <laughs> he's like spend some time down there feeling Oh, your callous feet. Jigglypuff comes out. <laughs> that was creepy. I... Alright. Wake up with those eyes just looking at you. There's a letter attached to the shoes. You've been served. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm wearing them. Like, how do you read the letter when it's already on the bottom of your foot? It's like hopping up and down with the one foot tilted up. Falling over. Alright, thanks, Mom. Ah! Zero to 60. Jeez. Look, I'm in Peter City. I'm in New Theory. I'm in Peter City. I always love, like, if you were trying to hatch an egg and you kept doing this. Oh, of course. And, like, the music would just not understand what you were up to. This this is the best opening to <laughs> play through yet. Thank you for wasting your life. <laughs> oh, so this is one of the best parts in this game. There are... All right, that's two people, right? Come around here. I don't think you can go up there, but there's one. There's about six trainers that are just literally standing here. Yeah. What else I gotta do? They don't got dreams. <laughs> <laughs> Come the Pokemon champions. Well, no, this is another thing we talked about in, in like four or five videos ago. Um, hey, does yeah, does everybody get the opportunity to become a Pokemon trainer like when they're a kid and go out? And it's mostly children here. Still mostly children. Uh, you don't have an electric attack, do you? Lucy? Yeah, he starts with Undershock. Pikachu. Yeah, but it's I level apologize. three versus nine. I'm not gonna. He's gonna kill me in one hit. I'll uh, take that challenge, see, sir. Ooh. I've been doing, you know, World of Warcraft. They have the pet battles in there. Yeah. Pokemon World of Warcraft. Well, that's not... Where, to get the experience, they have to at least do some damage. 
before switching out. Instead of actually so, so, I just apologize appearing. for that. I'm not... You know what's um what's a really weird thing in the new ones? The experience share. In in traditionally, in every Pokemon game, there's an item or two called the experience share. In Black and White 2, you actually got two of them. Uh, and what it does, of course, is it allows all the Pokemon... I'm sorry. Uh, any Pokemon that's not in the fight that has it equipped to gain experience for it. Hmm. In, uh, in, in Black and White, you got two of them. In the second Black and White. In X and Y, you actually get it and it... When it's active, when it's turned on, every Pokemon in your party that isn't in the battle gains a portion of half of the experience worth. So it's kind of a cool way to train an entire team. That was a good level. Actually, he got HP on speed, which is what he's going to get constantly anyway. Um, that's, I think that's cool, but I think it's do X and Y does a lot of things to make the game easier. Mm. For instance, if you catch a Pokemon, you still get experience. Okay. Yeah, it makes it less non-essential to capture Pokemon. Like, you can just kind of mess around and capture some things or doubles of things. And why wouldn't you anyway? That Pidgey actually messed Smog up. Jeez, let's get our pigeon in. Uh, another funny side note, and I'll kind of drop the X and Y thing for now, <laughs> but Pikachu actually has the Pikachu voice, like from the animated series. Nice. Like he shows up and he's like, "Got you, got you," and it's just like, "Wait a minute." Nice little touch. Yeah. Well, I'm wondering that, like, what's the baby Pikachu? Pichu. Pichu doesn't. Still makes a noise. So I'm assuming Raichu's gonna still make a noise too. This is not a fair fight here. Why are all her Pokemon better than my Pokemon? Oh, flaps. Well, you know, she's just been standing here. So, that's why. Do you think she's standing there and her Pokemon are all around her, just fighting wild Pokemon at her feet the entire time? Well, I imagine, like, old-style gang, where they're all just sitting back and they all have different pose. Yeah. Almost like a Japanese street gang. Yeah. Yeah. Or Grease. Grease We're mean. Stuff. That skirt is not keeping anything secret. Mm -hmm. I can see your hopes and dreams, girl. <laughs> I don't like them. Run away. Let's already go to the Pokemon Center. Two Pidgeys. Yeah, we beat a, a gym. <laughs> <laughs> Two Pidgeys. Oh, good. Good gravy. So while we're recovering our Pokemon, we're, I don't know if I even mentioned it. We're from GamingChronicles.com. I think I did. Uh, Poketoberfest was our celebration in the month of Pokemon. You can go to GamingChronicles.com to see articles and other videos based on that. Uh, we're now back to regular scheduled entertainment, including kind of the grand inaugural opening of the channel, the Pokemon, Pokemon, the Gaming Chronicles TV channel on YouTube. So... It's one of the guys we saw. No, now wait a minute. Is it though? Is it Rick or what was the other one? Now Colton. Colton. This guy was creeping on us. He was hiding. I saw him looking at us. Did you? Why don't you say something? I want to scare him off. <laughs> you wanted them to come back and come after us. Caterpie's uh, one of my favorite Pokemon. We've been through that. I have a Butterfree. What's not to like? Well, Smog doesn't like him, obviously. He just lit him up. Thought he was a dwarf. Light him up, up, up. I'm on fire. Oh, Weedle. So now we're just we're doing a classic Pokemon thing here. Yeah. Classic grinding. Yeah, it's it's what happens every time in every Pokemon game. We're grinding our Pikachu, Lucy Sacks. Ah, <laughs> uh, so he can stand a chance against something somewhere. So he could be of some use. Yeah. Some value. What is it? The only Pokemon we caught that we haven't used is Weedle? That sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Spiro. Did we catch one? Oh, uh, Spiro. I don't know if we even caught one. I don't remember. And we never we never saw any of the Nidoran. Which we wanted, but never... We never caught. Well, Lucy Sax. Level nice. 6 it is. There we go. Soon, Lucy Sax. Soon. Oh, that's oh. not useful. Ugh. Oh. You got another one? What do you got? Oh, Caterpie. Caterpie. Oh, well, let's put Lucy in again first. We gotta, we should pick the Sadie needs a little love, too. Because he's a bruiser. He's a bruiser. 
Caterpie. Caterpie. I'm just, I'm, I have an itchy trigger finger for murder. Have you, uh, you used, did you use a Pikachu that often? No. No? no. I did, in the original, like, red and blue. I mean, I, I always evolved with a Raichu. I remember it was, like, a thing because people loved the show, and that Pikachu never wanted to evolve. <sighs> Whatever, man. Well, and then if you ever played Yellow... Your starting Pokemon is Pikachu, yeah. and he's like the personality Pikachu, like he'll follow you around outside of the Pokeball, and you can talk to him, and he, like you get a little icon of a face whether he loves you or not. If you evolved him, that just stopped happening. <laughs> he wasn't. He did lose his personality, which is funny, and I still did it anyway. Oh, of course, I ain't got time to play. No, no one cares about personality. These anyone. Pokemon need to be murderers. You gotta we strip need, that away. We need to murder everyone else. This guy. Why, why did I just talk to you again? Alright. Okay, this is one of the funniest things, and it's in every Pokemon game. It's got to be a local translation thing or something like that. <laughs> hey. Uh, they're delightfully comfy and easy to wear. I can't disagree. He's not wrong. Mm -hmm. I'm not I'm not saying he's wrong. I back that statement. I'm saying 100%. it's... 100%. It's look at this kid. Those are, those are high guys. He's a kid. They, they can be a little... A little high. Has he got sneakers or sandals on, though? Those could be sandals with socks. Oh, man. I don't... Yeah. And that backwards hat? It's not necessarily backwards. It's kind of to the side. I mean, his head is sort of on an angle, yeah. so maybe it is straight up backwards. Uh, we should kill this Pokemon. I think okay. so. Very good. None of this fainting stuff. <laughs> Go for blood, Lucy Sax! Murder him! Lucy Sacks fainted. Ooh, I didn't see that quick attack coming. No, well, it was so quick. Oh. Oh, good. <laughs> Lucy Sacks, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Uh, he's kind of the level for this too. <sighs> Let's just go with what we know. How about we'll see how this fight turns out next time on Gaming Chronicles presents the remainder to Poketober's playing with fire. Hmm. Hmm. hmm.